Alright guys, welcome back to more Let's Play Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance 2. We are in the Skull Gorge. Uh, we went over there into an orc cave that we can't like finish for some reason. So we're we're just gonna We're just gonna keep going around here. Uh, we have like a basilisk or something that we have to end up fighting here. Ooh, whoa, 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 hey, dude. We are really low on money now that I just realized. Boom. I don't know why I'm not ransacking these guys, but I should probably do that. Uh, and I also should turn down the volume on my TV. Uh, that's the volume. That's better. Okay. Yeah, an extra, extra eight damage never hurts anyone. Except for the guy I'm doing it to. And then he, and then he dies anyway. Wow. Okay, so I can't get down there. Um, and we have guys that will have... We'll, we will have no way of killing. Because of, like, regenerating hit points and things like that. Yeah, I said... Uh, Alright. I'll take a healing potion. That I don't mind. Give me that. Ooh, he ended up kicking out a lot of good stuff. Ooh, he did too. Especially, <laughs> we're gonna need um, all of this loot. Where are these guys coming from? All right. Well, you're not gonna give me anything. There we go. Um. Oh, I could have went down here. Oh, I'm stupid. Ooh, we're almost back to a thousand dollars. So, like, if we go up here, we have um. Those green guys there that we just saw a little leg of. Um, they can't be killed. Or at least I don't know of a way to kill them. So, but I should come this way because it is a... Uh, it is like a really good... Yeah, like boom. Fine Amulet of Protection 3. That's really cool. And then we can just kind of like ignore them. I mean, we'll, you know... Make sure that they fall to us. Oh boy, this is not going to go well. Alright, do that. Alright, well, I think he kicked me out of my uh, ransack ability. So we're just going to... We're going to do this. Just kind of ignore these guys, I think. And possibly get some extra loot. Yeah, there's 50... Oh! I am stuck. Nope. Not anymore. Okay. Oh, boy. That one... Lo oh, that's a big one. That is a really big one. Um... Eh. No. Do not surround me. There's a save spot there, too. Oh, wow. That was 800 bucks. No, no, no. Let me out. Are you gonna... Okay, you know what? Screw these guys. All right, there we go. I'm out. I'm out. They're not. They're not responding. They're not. They're not regaining their health. That makes me so happy right now. Okay, uh, we're gonna save our game because we actually killed some of those guys. Oh, that's. Like, can we only kill them here or something? There's a troll cave. Hmm. Well, wait. Come here. You. Maybe it has something to do with fire. Maybe I need to kill them with fire magic. Hmm. But let's enter to the troll cave. Vahidra is her best when fighting unarmed. Oh, okay. So it's for the monk. I don't care. All right. Okay, so we got a nice little save thing there. Yep, fire definitely seems to help. All right. And you're dead. The four bolts is like almost an insta-kill. There we go. Wow. This is uh, actually going really well. 
Well, now I know how to kill these things. Oh god, spider. Why? How are you not dead? There you go. Not expecting spiders in the troll cave. You're not dead either. Why? This is a very old dragon idol with decorative stones in the eye sockets. At one time, there was a mechanism linked to the idol, but it's since been disactivated. Okay. So, what exactly does that mean for me? There was another idol over here that we saw. Yeah, uh, nope, that's not an idol. That's just a save game spot. Can I go over here? Ooh. Alright, there we go. I think I missed, like, a pathway or two, but we'll get to that in a minute. I think the trolls gave us a crap ton of experience, which is nice. All right, there we go. So let's go back this way. Yeah, this looks better. Ooh, I see two things of uh, gold there. Which I'm hoping is uh, a good amount. Because we could really use some money after buying a... Uh, what did I buy, anyway? It's been a couple of days since I played. A remarkable angelic uh, morning star. Oh, hey, I found Halbert that I could sell. Whoa, wait, okay. Scale mail. All the chain mail's slightly better, but that's in hand. That's magic. Hmm. Maybe I need to magic that. Two emeralds, huh? Okay. Alright, well, maybe I'll need to make a uh, better chain mail. Flawless amulet, grand great axe. I cannot take. All right, well let's uh let's recall. Now we got to make a decision. Do we keep the chainmail that we have, or do we go with the upgraded one and eventually make that magical? All right. Uh, so I can sell stuff to you, buddy. Um, let's see. I'm not using the shield, but that shield is actually pretty good. Okay, I don't care about any of that. This is the item I'm thinking of. Um. Oh, wait. We have, uh. Superior. Oh, the spear crossbow is better than that. That's why we have it. Okay. And then good there. Okay. Now, what? How many emeralds do I have? If any. I have two there. Hmm. I have a couple of rune stones. Okay, don't need the fine amulet or the remarkable ring. Amulet of protection, I mean, plus three armor class. That's pretty good. Okay, so let's uh, workshop. Break that down. Yes. And then we'll sell the amulet. You will find no other merchant with quality and prices to match mine. Okay, so if we were to go in the workshop on this piece of armor, find my emerald, be a plus two fine fey chain mail, and then I could also add in, not power attack, shock resistance. Fire, cold, shock, acid damage, or uh, poison damage resistant. That's actually pretty dang good. Hmm. The diamonds make it very interesting. Acid and poison resistance. Reduces duration of slow and stun. Ooh. Cold resistance. 1% increased treasure drops on the pearl. Jet gives me five more hit points. Fire resistant. Reflect 5% of melee when struck. And a shield expert. Not that one. Diamond's pretty good. Plus 6 on the fire, cold, 
on, on that type of energy resistance. That's actually pretty good. Yeah, so let's actually... Let's let's see here. If I were to break this down, it'd be a thousand dollars. Okay, so seeking arms and armor, I have everything. Sure, we'll do that, and then we'll sell. I should be able to have enough money. That's my thinking. That's going to be very close. Actually, you know what? I'm going to make sure that I get it. Uh, you don't need this many recalls. Don't need that many rejuvenations. More emeralds there. We'll get rid of a couple healing potions too. Okay. Workshop. Onto this armor. Do the rune stones. We'll do the emeralds because that actually helps out quite a bit. Um, do I do diamond or do I do. Uh, what was the other one? The pearl? The pearl seems pretty good. Now, where's my emeralds? Okay, that... Oh. Okay, that would be pretty dang good, but I need 19,000 for that. I think we could get 19,000 easily. So let's, uh, let's equip the chainmail for now. Alright, and we'll recall back. Because, I mean, we got we got a couple of things that we can end up grabbing. Like that great axe, for example. Uh, and, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll be able to ransack stuff, too. Probably not from spiders, but... Yeah, definitely not from spiders, it seems. I think it has to be something that could theoretically carry... Um, loot. Alright, there you go. Take a rejuvenation potion. I think uh, we'll be at the. Yeah, here we go. Oh boy. You gotta not do that to me, buddy. Oh yeah, here we go. Ransack. Oh, we got a pearl out of it. That's actually pretty decent. Did I just get a superior scale mail? Is that better than what I'm wearing? It is awesome. So we can end up selling the uh, fine chain mail. <laughs> I'll take that. And that... Alright. Okay, so I don't think there was a... Really a way out of here. Not that I saw other than, you know, the entrance that we came in. Nope, nothing there. Oh, but there is a... I see possibly a space I didn't go into. Over here. Healing potion. Remarkable ring of protection. Healing potion. Remarkable for full plate boots. Wow. That was... That was just free. Okay. That is awesome. All right. There we go. Give me that money. 204 bucks. I mean, I'll take it. And yeah, I'm definitely going to end up saving. All right. So, that's the one I'm saving over. That's actually pretty nice. What it so we already broke down the protection. Um, wow, yeah, plus three armor class on that ring. That's pretty nice. Now let's see here. Remarkable full plate boots, fine full plate boots. Well, we're gonna wear those. And remarkable studded leather, we don't need. So we can actually sell the chainmail that we had just picked up, so. It's actually pretty nice. Alrighty, so I think when we come back, I'm going to save again since we just equipped a new uh, 
new piece of armor. And I want to take a look at the stats just real quick. 80 armor, and that's not... Um, and that's why we don't have the Morning Star. And now we have... Oh, wait. I have to re-equip the shield. 91 armor. <laughs> that is awesome. So, um... When we come back, uh, I think we're done with the Trolls Cave, so we'll end up going out and we'll actually kill the Trolls since we know how now. So, thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you back here for more Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance 2. Take care.